And I'm, I'm very blessed that you all are here, and uh, as we can look around, there's, there's empty chairs, and those people that could be here, but for whatever reason, they're not, and that's okay, we'll pray for them, and they will see something like this next time. And uh, that's a challenge to all of you, next time you come, bring more people with you. Um, because it's the size of the message that we have tonight that is, that is kind of be falling on empty chairs, and that's really the thing that kind of breaks my heart. But I'm honored and, and very blessed to be up here to talk to you guys tonight about something that is very near and dear to my heart, something that I'm very passionate about, and something that my business partner, Vince Como, who's sitting there in the, in the second row, we decided to get involved with this a little over about, oh, about a year and a half ago. Um, but uh, just so that I know, and I, I have a hard time talking without a dry erase marker in my hand, so forgive me if I keep going back and dropping it off. Um, just by a show of hands, who is hearing about Life Antigen Pro Tandem for the very first time? Please raise your hand. Okay, so three people. Fantastic. Okay, so the, for the, who's a distributor? Raise your hand if you're a distributor already. Okay, so we've got a lot of distributors in the, in the room. Fantastic. Um, what you're going to hear tonight is, for those of you who are new, you're going to hear something that is incredible as far as what it can do for the health of people, but you're also going to hear something incredible what it can do for the finances. And right now when we're dealing in an economy that is somewhat challenged and arguably the worst in, in a long, long time, this is going to be some great information for you. So I just invite you to open your eyes, open your hearts, and open your minds and be receptive to what you're going to hear about tonight. And I don't want to spend too much time telling you about myself and why I'm here, but I think it's noteworthy to know. Um, I have the title of Dr. Nettles because I was a chiropractor up until February of this year. I was a family wellness chiropractor for 12 years. And uh, I moved with my, and actually I want to, so I'm going to try to say this, what I'm about to tell you without breaking up. But my why is here tonight. And that is my wife and my two children that are in the back there. Mia and my two children. This is the first time my daughter Marina and my son Dietrich have ever heard daddy present. And so this is, a, this is really touching for me. Um, but when I got involved with this, it was on a very part-time basis. And I never saw myself doing anything other than what, at that point in my life, God had called me to do. And that was to be a family wellness chiropractor. And uh, for two reasons. Because I loved what I did, and I hated network marketing. Um, and that combination, I didn't, think, I didn't see myself doing anything else. In fact, I had a very, very large disdain. And I hate the word hate, but I did really not like it at all. Um, and it wasn't, and it was based on pure ignorance. I didn't know anything about it. My exposure to it was the people that were representing the products that happened to be distributed through network marketing efforts. And uh, I'm not going to mention any of their names, but they sound and sound a lot like Zango and Monavie. Um, <laughs> but these, these people would literally be rude to my staff, try to solicit my patients when they came into my office that had a sign that said no soliciting on it. And I didn't like those tactics. I didn't like the way these people were ignoring it or either that or they, none of them could read. But the issue is that that was my experience with network marketing. And prior to being a chiropractor, I didn't literally know what network marketing was. I didn't have anybody in my family or friends, associates that had ever done it. And so that was my introduction to it and I didn't like it. But when I found out about this product, it changed the whole game for me. And it was because of what it could do, what I had seen it done in research, and, and hopefully you understand this and can respect this, is that as a doctor, I didn't know anybody who was on this product that had a testimonial to share with me. But I did read the research, and when, when Colt and Blue, Elam, who are my direct enrollers from a little south of here in Tucson, when they gave me, or they showed me this opportunity, they showed me the research, and I read it, I called them back and I said, you guys have no idea what you have your hands on. If what this research says is true, you have no idea what you're dealing with. We've never seen anything like this in science. And I think that gave them a little bit more enthusiasm. It definitely gave me a lot more enthusiasm. And I was looking at it, quite frankly, understanding how could something so significant, published in tier one peer-reviewed journals, be somewhat unheard of. And I didn't know that at the time I was hearing about it that it was on the shelves of GNC at that moment. And when we found out that it was, we went down and tried to buy some and couldn't buy any. And we were asking people that worked at GNC what it was, and one of them told us it was a sleep aid. They didn't even know what it was. So the whole point was to get this phenomenal product to as many people as possible, and the retail avenue was not the way of doing it. It hadn't been shown to be effective in six years, so we converted, thank God, to network marketing. And when that happened, it opened up this gigantic opportunity for people like us as distributors. And you're going to hear a little bit more about that tonight. But when I grasped onto that, and I fully understood the impact of that, I really had to do a reality check as far as what I was doing and what God had called me to do at that point. 
And that was, and I, I created a mission statement back in 1995, and I'll share it with you because it's really why I do what I do. Um, and a mission statement was my life's purpose in a sentence, and it was to empower as many families as divinely possible toward optimal health, happiness, and prosperity. And that was my entire focus in my life mission. And I realized that this fit that mission better than my chiropractic practice. In fact, when I was in my practice, I could at best help one person at a time because it was only my efforts and the efforts of my staff. But I could only adjust one person at a time. I'm not an octopus. And I realized that I had a decision to make. Do I help one person at a time or can I help thousands of people at a time with the leveraging of other people that are on my team who are also helping these people and have it expand? And once that really set in, in my gray matter, and sometimes I've got a very thick skull and I may take some time for that to happen, but I realized that being a chiropractor was not my best way of fulfilling my mission statement. And that's when I decided to do Life Vantage full time and give up my practice because I could help more people. So that's why I'm here. And I'm hoping that if, it, if just one person in here gets something from what I say tonight, then my time was well spent because that's what this, all, this is all about. It's about helping people understand at a higher level something that they don't currently know, and that is how important their health is and how important it is to bless other people with opportunities that they haven't quite yet heard about. And that's it. we're just going to share opportunities with you tonight. You're not, we're not going to lock the door, even though Steve is back there looking like he may want to. Um, we're not going to lock the door and force you to do anything you don't want to do. We're going to share information with you and ask you, does this sound like something you can see yourself participating in? And if it is, I cannot tell you that there's a better team in this entire company than is in this room right now. There are some phenomenal leaders in this room. There's Trish Albertson over here, whose husband and, and Eric, I think, have set a, a blazing trail for many of us to follow on how to put your heart and your mind behind the purpose bigger than you and grab a bunch of people and go do it. And we've got Mark Rogers right here, who is one of our also our leaders in our upline. And we've got my partner, Vince Cohen. We've got Jeremy Reheis in the back and Skip and Nina in the back. We've got a lot of leaders and Steve Boning in the back. We've got a lot of leaders in this room. And if I did not mention your name, I apologize. It's just because maybe I don't know who you are yet. And I would like you, if that is the case, to come and introduce yourself to me after this is over because I want to help you be a better leader by showing you what it's all about and helping you. And you don't have to be in my downline for that to happen because effectively, as Mark said, now I'm pro-7, you're all on my downline anyway, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> um, but I want to get right into it.